Hey guys, this is AMC Thorn, and this is the tutorial on how to draw eyes. When drawing eyes, there's various ways to draw it, various shapes that you can make into eyes. Um, I usually start off with drawing eyes. Well, kind of like default is either like oval or a circle, and then you just loop in like imagine like two triangles at the tip end. Then for like the iris, just a regular circle, the light for the eye, then like an oval for the pupil. That's one way to draw the eye, but sometimes the eye aren't always shaped like this. Because sometimes based on like the position of the face, they is at an angle or the character's face is at an angle. But sometimes, like in the previous um, tutorial, how to draw a head, her eyes were like triangles swooped over. That's one way you could draw an eye. I found some um, reference photos to try to describe how I was talking about earlier about how eyes can be various different shapes. Like what I was saying before, like with this, his eyes are basically, get a lot of colors, it's easier to see. His eyes, and that's not showing up. Okay, there we go. So basically, like the shape, basically like trapezoid like shape. And I turn the layer off. You see what I'm talking about? This is the shape that I created from his eyes. For this owl, you see that one eye is a different shape from the other. So when I go over the one's eye, one is a triangle and one is a cubish circle but it's more like a cube actually when i turn the layer off you see a triangle and a cube and i'm going to do one more i'm going to do these two eyes right here and right here you can tell that part of her eye is basically foreshortened based on her position of face. And actually, there's three more bears shaped with it with the eyelid. And it's kind of fuzzy since camera probably made this out of focus for reasons. I feel like it gives a certain fit, or basically, it's probably in lighting. But there's various ways to draw eyes. I might need to erase that clip. Let me repeat myself. You see now that. Eyes aren't perfect circles because I really had to use triangle like shapes or circle cubish like shapes and sometimes even very shaped all together to get the eyes of the people and or the animal side. You see that these two people's eyes are different shapes and you see that their eyes are different shapes but let me get back to a rough sketch um there's even various ways to draw like cartoonish eyes like you could draw eyes that's like with a parallel parallelogram or rhombus should eye. and usually with eyes you know they have like a membrane i'm going to try to get a little membrane added in here looking that up so you can see that and Add the light gleam in the eye and pupil. And one thing that iris has that I didn't add it on is it's like a membrane. I forgot what it's called, but I'll probably add the name of it into the comments below along with the names of the photographers of the photos that I use part of the tutorial. But usually like you see like a various change of the various colors so you can see that better but usually there's like a membrane in the iris that gives it, it color but also it's like a certain texture that looks bad and the color as well i don't know why i messed up that okay 
when you add in the arrows, pictures, you got to put out as sports, various colors for the plot. Very serious. I'm gonna make a rainbow eye. Yeah. There's various shapes, you can even use triangles, cubes, or actually that's another rhombus. You have to use squares, you use um, like half circles, triangles to get the eyebrow kind of look. In a way, that's like an anime character. I, well, I've also got to mention that you can even have eyes display certain emotions, like an anime, sometimes they add the eye shaking or like have the pupil like real small to show the least shock. But also like in certain lighting in real life, the pupil changes based on the amount of light that's in the room or in the surrounding. So this would be like the closer pupil when there's lots of light. And one will be bigger based on a low amount of light in the surrounding. Or also be dilated. This also could be like dilated pupils. Actually, dilated pupils might be close to that or a little bigger, but close. But yeah, curve this rhombus. And you can also like, get a snake eye or a reptile's eye doing this. Or curve down square to get a frog's eye. I made the wrong shape, shape pupil for that, but I get what I'm trying to do. But yeah, there's various ways to draw eyes. Okay, that probably look more like a frog's eye now. Okay, yeah. but yeah. But this concludes it for this tutorial on eyes, because yeah, I think I covered the majority of what I covered for this section. Okay, and um, I'm going to add the links for the artist's photos that I use for reference down below and get ready to start on the next tutorial which will be on body portion and structure or how to draw the body or for the character. So this is AMC Thorn out.